Time right now is 514 as we look at the latest track of Hurricane Laura. It's expected to make landfall as a strong Category 4 hurricane anywhere from Bolivar Peninsula to Lake Charles. We have both Britta and Cambrell in house following Laura's track. We'll hear from them in just a few moments. But first, let's get on over to Channel 2's Amy Davis live in Kima where mandatory evacuations are in place there. Amy. Hey, yeah, that's right, Lisa. So mandatory evacuations here. The mayor said they based that decision on the fact that the National Weather Service is predicting a five to ten foot storm surge here in Kima. Of course, it's right on the water. We're right here along the Kima boardwalk. There are some houses here just to my left. Um, but Judge Lena Hidalgo yesterday issued voluntary evacuation orders for areas in southeast Harris County. Effective immediately. I am formally declaring a voluntary evacuation of residents in evacuation zones A and B in Harris County. These are the coastal areas of Harris County bordering Galveston Bay. This includes parts of Seabrook, Baytown, Taylor Lake Village, Sore Acres, Laporte, Morgan's Point, Nassau Bay, Friendswood, El Lago, Deer Park, South Houston portions of Pasadena and Clear Lake. These zones are based on your zip code. There we go. Yeah, we can't control anything. Some families in Seabrook plan to stay while others are packing up. No, we're going to leave. We're going to leave. No sense in riding it out. We've got kids and family. No sense. Yeah, so whatever you decide to do, you need to make that decision. Actually, yesterday, as soon as possible, they want to get people who need to get out and who want to evacuate, keep the roads clear for those people. And, you know, this isn't punitive. So basically, if you decide to stay and wait it out and the water does rise in areas like here in Kingwood uh, and Kima and Southeast Harris County, they say, you know, if you change your mind when that water comes up, it just may take quite some time for first responders to get Get to you to make a rescue. If you're not sure if you're in an area under evacuation, you can go to readyharris.org and see if your zip code is in either zone A or zone B. There are voluntary evacuation orders for both zones A and zone B. We are live in Kima. I'm Amy Davis, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Thank you, Amy.